In other news, the Ministry of Labour says it could take time to review workers' salaries following the move to block the gazettement of the Wages Council in court. The Ministry has noted that the collective bargaining agreement that is conducted annually by different unions had been affected by the ongoing process. Speaking during the annual Agricultural Employers Association Conference, Labor Cabinet Secretary Simon Chilgui noted that the gazettement of the council has been challenged in the High Court, paralyzing the process of setting the minimum wage by the council as set in the Labor Act. Two months ago, I gazetted the wages council, including some nominees from the employers and employees, the social partners in that sector. But Going by the Kenyan spirit, some fellows thought that they were not suitable and they took everybody to court. And now we are in court, we don't know what, uh, what we are facing, what uh, they will make all manner of allegations. Not just for wages council, but all the appointments done by government in that gazette notice, 243 appointments. So again, we are stuck there. According to Chelugui, the move to bar the wages cancelled would have a negative implications on workers' welfare in the coming days. The wages council play a very important role in advising the cabinet secretary in determination of minimum wage and salary. So without it, we have a challenge in sustaining our CBAs, rely on the advisory from the wages council. And also employers, employees use that in terms of negotiating and it allows employers to plan with predictability and certainty based on what has been recommended. The CS says the matter is now in the hands of the Attorney General with the hope that it will be resolved fast and amicably.